as President Nelson mentioned, we must decide now. President Monson, back in October 2010, said, decisions are constantly before us. To make them wisely, courage is needed. The courage to say no. The courage to say yes. Decisions do determine destiny. I plead with you to make a determination right here, right now, not to deviate from the path which will lead to our goal, eternal life with our Father in heaven. <clears throat> in Alma chapter 24, verse 19, we see uh, with the people of Ammon that they were firm and would suffer even unto death rather than commit sin. And now this word firm means strongly felt and unlikely to change in a resolute and determined manner. Joshua 24, verse 15 says, choose you this day whom ye will serve. And um, President Uchtdorf in a conference talk back in October 2013 said, Brethren, there may be times in our lives when rising up and continuing on may seem beyond our own ability. That day on a snow-covered slope, I learned something. Even when we think we cannot rise up, there is still hope. And sometimes we just need someone to look us in the eyes, take our hand and say, you can do it now. And if I could look you in the eyes, I would echo Elder Uchtdorf's, or at this time, President Uchtdorf's statement, you can do it now. In Alma chapter 52, it says in verse 19, and in the commencement of the twenty and eighth year, Moroni and Teancum and many of the chief captains held a council of war, what they should do to cause the Lamanites to come out against them to battle, or that they might be, by some means flatter them out of their strongholds, that they might gain advantage over them and take again the city of Mulek. So uh, we need to look for resources and opportunities to counsel with a trusted friend, family member, and even a uh, licensed professional therapist or church leader when and where appropriate. Elder Neil A. Maxwell said, Act, my brothers and sisters, for once the soul is tilted toward belief, and once there is even a desire to believe, then marvelous things begin to happen. Once one leaves the porch and comes inside the church, then one not only hears the music more clearly, he becomes a part of it. Act now, so that a thousand years from now, when you look back at this moment, you can say, this was a moment that mattered. This was a day of determination. The truth is that not yet usually means never.